April 14, 1970, rookie astronauts Fred Hayes and Jack Swigert and Commander Jim Lovell, a veteran of three NASA missions, are two days into the third moon landing attempt on Apollo 13. This loud bang occurred. I could hear and saw some warping of the uh, metal in the tunnel. The you know, lights started to flash and jets started to fire and I looked up at Fred to see if he knew what was causing all this commotion and I could tell he didn't know. Warning lights indicate something is wrong with the electrical system. Then more lights. Two out of the three fuel cells have just died. Well, then we've had a problem here. Can I say again, please? Uh, -huh. uh Houston, we've had a problem. See, and it looks to me, looking out the uh, hatch, that we are venting something. We are venting something out uh, into space. What the astronauts saw was frozen oxygen spilling out of their own air supply. At that moment, everybody recognized that this was survival. And we started moving in an entirely different fashion. Mission Control has been handed the job of their lives. Without inventive solutions, the crew will perish. Their crisis is immediate. In the command module, both oxygen and power are dwindling fast. Okay, let's make sure that we don't do anything that will cause us to lose fuel cell number two. On the stricken spacecraft, energy is in short supply. So all superfluous life support systems are shut off. But even with everything powered down, the air supply will not hold out long enough. The three astronauts are exhaling deadly CO2 into the tiny lunar module. The amount of pressure of carbon dioxide was building up in the lunar module. Spare canisters in the command module could save the crew, but these spares are square and the lunar module carbon scrubber is round. Mission Control needs to figure something out. So engineering comes up with the idea to fabricate an adapter to fit the square scrubber into the round hole, test it in the laboratories, and voice the instructions up to the crew. And they used uh, duct tape, a uh, piece of cardboard, uh, and a piece of plastic, and an old sock. Uh, literally was in minutes, the crew could see the carbon dioxide pressure uh, starting to drop. The harrowing ordeal of Apollo 13 was a stark reminder that we had not tamed space. Ultimately, it was the highly skilled teamwork of mission control that saved the day.